This is tutorial number 88, and it covers plastic and forging calculations within CATIA V5. To start off, open up tutorial part number 87, which is located on the DVD. Now, what we're going to do in this tutorial is I'm going to show you how to calculate plastic and forging costs. So, when you send in a part to get a quote, so say we're going to send this part in, uh, not only are they going to look at how difficult it would be to create this, say, in a plastic or forging process, they also want to know how much volume there is because with the volume that's how much liquid they're going to be pouring in to the mold to create your uh, your part. So to do this we're going to have to use the measure item so let's click it and we're going to have to do the opposite of what we did in the last tutorial to calculate the coating and plating. So we're going to have to click customize and make sure that you have volume selected and take away the area. Click OK now select the entire part and it's going to tell you how much volume the entire part takes up. Now again this is important as when you're getting a uh, a pricing for a plastic uh, even rubber uh, forging any type of any type of uh, uh, manufacturing process that a liquid's going to be used they want to know how much volume there's going to be so that they can charge you uh, appropriately for the volume and how hard it is to actually make that component. So again, when you're measuring for a plastic or forging part for a quotation, make sure that you uh, customize it and make sure that it's on the volume for your measure item. So you're able to measure it and you're able to give that volume to whoever it is you're getting your quote from to get a quote for your part to be made either as a plastic, a rubber, or a forging. And that concludes our tutorial on how to get a plastic and forging calculation within CATIA V5.